you immediately think of cotton, but a new exhibition in Blackburn celebrates a more contemporary newcomer to the industry, the trainer. Yes, 1,200 pairs of Adidas shoes are on display with 200 special edition Blackburn trainers sold off today for charity. You can just see them over my shoulder right. there. Oh. <laughs> well, the red stripe is for the Lancashire Rose, apparently. Collectors queued through the night to get their hands on them, as I've been finding out. Here it goes long been an integral part of music and fashion, sport too of course, but for Darwin designer Gary Aston, the trainer is embedded in Northwest culture, on the football terraces, dance floors, an expression of identity. People always associate trainers and sportswear with hip hop culture nowadays which came from the US, but in the UK it was happening in the North and the Northwest from the late 70s really. Gary owns 2,000 pairs of Adidas trainers many of them here in the exhibition at Blackburn's Old Cotton Exchange. I go watching Blackburn Rovers and I'll see dads with their kids and the kids and the dads are wearing the kind of designer anoraks and Adidas trainers. The northwest of England's probably got the highest con concentration of Adidas collectors in the world. Sneaker superfans have queued for two days and come from across the world to see the exhibition and buy their own rare pair of the trainers. We come yesterday afternoon at two o'clock. That shoes for you about half eleven. So you've been here all night? Yeah. You've come all the way from LA. Why? It's definitely a culture be within a culture. The relations I've made out here in the streets, you know, that's that's probably one of the best things that I'm gonna take back. And this is what everyone here is trying to get their hands or feet on. Two hundred limited edition pairs of trainers. They've got the word Blackburn emblazoned on them, and hundred percent of the profits of the sales of these are to go to a local homelessness charity, Night Save. I'm not going to wear these now. I'm going to get the general lease version and wear the hell out of them ones. But these are cracking. He's got about 140 pairs, something like that. You said? Yeah. <laughs> My son has them, the other one's got them. And why? I don't know, they just love them. They just love them, they look smart. The exhibition is part of the first British textile biennial, which runs throughout October across Lancashire. It's art. You know, and it's a really accessible art form. Last night at the, at the launch party, it was incredible to see hundreds and hundreds of, dare I say, middle-aged men who were all really engaged in talking about design, colour, shape, form. Oslo, London and now Blackburn. The town and the trainer a perfect fit. So you got... I didn't get a pair. <laughs> But you found a bloke who'd come all the way from Los Yeah, and that wasn't it. Australia, uh, Hong Kong. Unbelievable. But lots of people wouldn't go camping. I think they took the day off to do it. Go for it. Exercise equals pain. Nothing wrong with a good pair of black shoes. Right, uh, let's but, move on to sport. Yeah, let's move on to sport. There's a busy weekend.